What's good YouTube? Welcome to my first video and it's a big one. Want to see what a $1,750 tattoo looks like? Stay tuned then you'll find out. So like I said, this is my first video and I just want to give you a little introduction to who I am, a little bit about myself, why I'm making the videos and why I've made this page. So welcome, my name is Justin. I'm 25 years old and from Toronto, Canada. So my passion and it's been my passion for a long time is tattoos. I know I have a couple but I also like my Instagram, like I just follow a bunch of different tattoo artists, pages about just constant tattoos, it's like realistic, you know, different uh, geometry. But I, I'm not gonna leave it off right now just to ramble, but again, my passion is tattoos and I just wanna bring to you guys my knowledge of what an average Joel is. I'm not an artist, so I'm not gonna say uh, my, my words is their word, but I am gonna tell you I know a decent amount about my tattoos, about tattooing in general, placement and all that. So I kind of want to bring that to you guys. So first off, I'm going to thank you guys for clicking and watching it this far. Uh, I know some of you may be just here for the clickbait of the, the title itself. And some of you may be interested to actually see what the tattoo is going to happen. And then some of you are just, you don't even like tattoos and you're just here because, and you know what, that's fine. I'm just gonna keep going. And then hopefully you kind of get an understanding of my tattoos and the kind of style, style I like and then you know I'm here to show you what the best of the best is going to be pretty much like I'm getting an expensive tattoo and it's not just for show it's because I believe that you get what you pay for with tattoos so like if you would like if you want to see I just got a couple myself these are all about the same price and you know now it's time to get this arm done and I'm getting it done pretty much all in the shot of a month because uh, my artist is here for the month. He's a guest artist, so he comes from Spain. Um, and yeah, so I've been saving up a lot of money to get the rest of this arm done. Uh, hopefully you guys like it. And uh, just, you know, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, best thing to do, actually I would like the best if you could just comment on my tattoos and see what you like so far. And then, you know, stay tuned watch the whole video this video is going to be in the pro it's going to show the whole process of getting a tattoo me going to the tattoo shop me meeting with my artist me me and us going through the process of getting everything you know designed and then you know the stenciling the layout and the tattoo itself and then i'm going to come back here again and you're going to see that uh pretty much this blank canvas is going to finally have a new product on it and it's going to stay there for perm permanently so I just want everybody to know how like an average Joe like me just appreciates the work and like there's, I know I'm rambling and like, please forgive me. Like, no, this is my first video. So I'm going to ramble. I know the audio may not be the best. I mean, all the, uh, visualing may not be, you know, up to par, but I hope to uh, bring you guys more videos on tattooing, you know, again, comment in the comments, what you want to know. I can come back and answer. I can make videos on them. I know I, I follow a lot of artists I can message them and ask them myself if I don't know but yeah so please guys just stay tuned I know at the end of this video it's gonna be you're gonna be amazed at what this is look, gonna look like because I'm gonna be I'm already, I'm excited beyond belief to see what it's gonna be I've been waiting a year for this to get this whole arm done so it's gonna be a big uh, it's gonna be a big reveal so thank you so much and uh, stay tuned what's good guys today's the day where I'm getting it done so just gonna give you an overview of what it, uh, how the day's gonna go. Sorry, I'm not gonna be able to look that much. Uh, I'm driving, might get a little bouncy, but anyway. So today is the day I am getting my tattoo done. Uh, it's at one of my favorite shops in Toronto. It's the place I usually recommend to everybody that asks about my tattoos and where to go. Um, it's called Bamboo Tattoo Studios. Uh, in terms of why I recommend them all the time is their work is just phenomenal. And um, yeah, you, they usually get a, a bunch of guest artists that come from different parts of the world, Spain, Cuba, there's just everywhere. And the work that's thrown out of it is just incredible. Like I've never really seen a bad piece come out of that shop. So for me, I may be a bit biased, but for who to go to i always recommend them and hopefully if you guys ever if you're in toronto look it up because that's probably one of my top choices i know there's a couple others 
like Chronic Inc., there's FY Inc., there's a couple other places that are really high or well known in Toronto, but in terms of for my choice and my pick, it is definitely Bamboo Tattoo Studios. And um, so I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna meet with my artist today. So his name's Evo, he's my artist, he's my guy. I've been waiting a year for this guy to come back. Uh, he's literally the only person I think that I want to tattoo me for the rest of my, like, all my, cause I got plans, I got a back piece planned, I got another lake sleeve, I got a bunch of shit planned. So you'll see, you'll get to see all that, but still, so. He's gonna be, I'm gonna be meeting with him today. Hopefully there's no hiccups. I got all my ideas ready. I got uh, printouts to show him about what I plan to do with the arm and what he thinks. So I'm hoping that, you know, both our ideas kind of mesh together. Again, I trust him completely. So, you know, if I had an idea to put something in a certain spot, like right here, I have a certain idea. And if he doesn't like it, then you know what? We'll change it up. Cause again, he's the, art, he's the artist, he's the professional and I trust him and I trust him completely. So pretty much when I meet him at pretty much 11, so in a couple minutes, like half an hour, we're gonna go over to the design and hopefully because this is a plan to do my whole sleeve, we'll be, uh, we'll, be video we'll be doing the whole sleeve in one shot kind of design wise. So at least we can plan ahead. And then we'll probably just get one section done. Most likely I see us doing my forearm today that's the plan I've had the whole time. It's gonna be the session in itself. So yeah, we'll get the design done. And then once that's done, you know, put the, he's gonna print it out. He's gonna stencil it. He's gonna put it on me. Hopefully the layout and everything is perfect. And then once that's good, wait about 20 minutes for it to uh, dry. And then, sorry. And then uh, we'll get to tattooing. And then it should be about, I would say six to eight hours worth of tattooing. It's gonna be a long day. I got my bag packed. I got snacks packed. I got food packed. Fucking bikes. Uh, and yeah, so then uh, you'll get to see me get the tattoo done, and then hopefully, yeah, you like the process and everything and how it goes. <laughs> up guys welcome back i told you i had a treat for you and i do pretty much i got uh, my first session done uh it was a long day it took about i got there at 11 didn't leave until 12 a.m but at the same time there were a couple hiccups along the way a couple other people had to come in and talk to my artist so you know 
every little bit kind of added up so I would say about the whole process took about about nine hours from the design to the actual execution of the tattoo uh, we also did go over more of the whole sleeve design so again I have a video coming to you soon about the whole sleeve but that also took up some time in terms of just instead of just doing this specific little piece right here but here I got to let's do the unveil so Hopefully you guys like it. I did a little uh, patchwork to hide it. Let's do it there. And there you go. This is what the tattoo looks like. So pretty much I went with the Colosseum. And then I had a statue of Julius Caesar. The portrait statue of it to end it off. So pretty much it, exactly, it went exactly how I went to plan. Um... I was kind of, uh, we were kind of, uh, you know, going back and forth on what we should do on design and, you know, we decided that this one was best and, you know, what I love it, I absolutely fucking love it, it came out phenomenal, like again, just look at it, <laughs> look at the, the Colosseum itself, he just nailed, and then his face, you know, just the lips, the chin, the eyes, like everything, this guy just... Blended in nicely with my other tie, my uh, tiger tattoo. So, yeah, that's uh, that's my tattoo. I know I didn't give you guys maybe enough videos in between me getting tattooed and like the whole process itself. That was just because you know I didn't have really the best angles to get a, a good tattoo. Every angle I tried getting, he was tattooing, and just and you pretty much just saw a guy's head. So. I thought there's no point in putting that in, but I tried to get you guys a couple about how the shop looks and uh, just the vibe you get from that sh that place and uh, couldn't be happier. I actually, I really couldn't be happier. I'm excited. Next week, I got another uh, another one. We're going to do the inner arm, uh, the inner bicep, which is going to be a big fucking bitch because this one's going to, this is one of the most painful spots, but that one, worse than my ribs. And then uh, the next week after that, I got two back to back, and that's when we were gonna pretty much do the uh, outer arm, and that'll complete the sleeve. But uh, let me tell you a bit about this piece. So, like I said in the, I'll tell you the price, everything I paid, what I tipped, and the pain, and all that. Just go through and kind of give you guys an understanding of what it, what it was for me. So pretty much, like I said in, in the video and in the head title, that this is a seventeen hundred fifty dollar tattoo session. I didn't pay that. I paid fifteen hundred because I've been such a long customer with the guy, and I've given so much business to the shop and just my business, and then uh, recruiting other people. So I did get a bit of a deal. Still, it is a seventeen hundred fifty dollar tattoo because I did. That's what he charges now, and pretty much that's what this piece would be, even if I didn't know the guy. So this is what you get for that kind of money. Not in, yeah, you could say you can get $1,500 too, but in, in all terms, this is what you get $1,750. And then, you know, I tipped the guy $100, you know, just because he, he he put a lot of time into it, you know, it, it was a long, we stayed until 12 a.m. He got, he got out even later and he just, the detail he goes into, he does, he just makes sure like it's perfect. Like he makes me stand up every, every 45 minutes, he'll make me stand up take about 10 steps back from him and then he'll examine the tattoo and I can't tell you how many times he steps back and he's like gotta go darker and I fucking hate hearing that because you just got that means you gotta go over the same spot again and I swear to god we went over like this area his cheeks and that at least four times and it killed but worth it and the other day you know pain is beauty it's only temporary pain they say that that all that that's what i had to keep telling myself because you know this hurt like a bitch i had this one done and man i thought it was gonna be a breeze because i don't remember this one hurting at all so i go into this one and right off the bat i'm like oof, that hurts so pretty much yeah that that was painful i'm not looking forward to this one at all hopefully maybe my body gets into the groove and you know maybe it is a little better but Again, temporary pain for permanent beauty. So please like, subscribe, share it with everybody. Uh, and honestly, I want to hear all your comments. I want to hear, you know what, did I pay, did I pay too much for this? 
if you're here because you like tattoos and if you're not you just hopefully you like the piece for itself because i know a lot of people that don't like tattoos end up seeing my work and they say that's art it's not even a tattoo that's art so hopefully you guys that don't like tattoos can watch this and be like wow that's an and appreciate the work that was done because this guy just he knocked it out of the park like i want to just look at him so again guys like subscribe comment show me the love i want to hear again what you guys think of it and if you have any other uh questions um i have uh i just made an instagram uh page i'll put that in the link i doesn't have anything but if you have any questions you can you know just dm me on that and hopefully i can uh, find out and get back to you so thank you so much and um uh, get ready because more are coming your way i still got one two and three videos to come and show you my full sleeve so take care guys